excited for that. The main card is very good in all five fights. I'm very excited for the Li Jing Liang and Carlos Brates fight as well. I'm a big fan of Carlos Brates. I think he is a um, very, very, very good prospect, and he's the real deal, so hopefully he can get a win this weekend. But yeah, um, that should be fun to watch. I'm excited. Um, I'll probably watch that TV right behind me, that old TV. I just got that old TV from my friend, actually, um, because his grandma was, like, clearing out her house, and she had a bunch of old stuff and old cameras, and he uh, gave that to me for free, so big shout out to him. Uh, but yeah, also, he, yeah, like I said, he found a bunch of cameras and stuff, so I think we're going to use those to like shoot music videos and uh, little maybe like mini short horror film stuff like that. So I'm excited about that. Um, yeah. I'm going to make a separate channel just called Mr. Boogeyman where I'm going to put my music and uh, maybe yeah, like just some other random stuff, but mostly music. Um, I don't know when, probably within the next month. I have two songs finished, but I have a bunch I need to record still. So I'm excited to share that. I've really just been spending a lot of time just making music recently, pretty much all my time. I wake up, I shower, and I eat breakfast, and then, um, yeah, I make music. Sometimes at night, sometimes during the day. And then I like to go on walks and I like to go outside for at least a few hours a day. And that makes me feel happy. That's very important. I suggest that you take a long walk if you have it in a while. It's the best. It's the best. Um, but yeah, I've been spending a lot of time making music, so I'm excited to share it. Me and my friends went and saw a trap the other week, or last week, and it was uh, pretty decent. I'll give it like a six and a half, seven out of ten. I want to go watch it again, but when we're watching the trailers, um, Beetlejuice came up, and I cannot wait for that. I am so, 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 so excited. I am so, 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 so excited. TV before we go, but I am pumped, so excited for that, and also Coraline, um, the 3D, they're re-releasing in 3D on Friday, I think, so I'm also going to go watch that probably, which will be exciting, um, I need to film the Coraline role-playing so I can put that out soon, but yeah, those are two movies I'm looking for. Nosferatu as well, um, which is releasing in, on uh, Christmas though, so I wish it was releasing October, but still, I will be watching that when that comes out, but yeah, those are the main movies I'm excited to watch, um, especially Nosferatu, because um, I just love vampires in like, vampire movies so, so, so much. Um, I just watched Blade for the first time, like, two months ago. I watched two and three as well, which weren't as good, but were still solid. But the original Blade, it was so, 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 so fire. I had to let that truck pass, but yeah, Blade was so fire. It's probably my new favorite superhero, honestly. Because I always knew who he was, but I never knew he had anything to do with vampires. I thought he was just like, some of, I don't even know what I thought, but... Yeah, once I found that out, I was very excited, and, uh, yeah, Blade is just drippy, Burgos hard, Wesley Snipes, so fire, um, damn it, I keep forgetting what I'm gonna say, yeah, I was
was thinking about just about all the vampire movies and I don't think anyone's really made like a vampire like slasher or they probably have but I want to make a vampire slasher one day that'd be like my dream my dream movie to make um I don't know maybe I'll call it a la carte like based on the sun of Dracula and have him go around just fucking killing everybody be fire. Just an idea, don't steal it. If you do, at least get me on the writing squad or something, I don't know. But yeah, I really like vampire movies. And just any movie to do with like supernatural Halloween type stuff is gonna be my favorite. Um, we got the Halloween 3 poster right behind me. I love, 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 love Halloween 3, even though it's a departure from the first two. As a kid, I loved, loved it as well, because I know a lot of people don't like it, but the mask and the whole idea of the film is so fire. They were originally, well, they made, John Carpenter made Halloween 1 and 2, and then they were just going to keep making Halloween, like Halloween 3, Halloween 4. But they were going to be like completely different stories. That's why Halloween, Halloween 3 was different. So Halloween 4 was supposed to be the same, like just random spin off story. But Michael Myers is so popular that they said, fuck that. Uh, let's make some money. And they just made all the Michael Myers films. So but I'm not complaining. I love Michael Myers. Definitely my favorite um, slasher. I have said this before, but Halloween uh, 1978 is probably my most watched movie of all time, maybe. Um, either that, or like, probably Goonies. Um, what else? The Santa Claus, or Hocus Pocus, probably those four, are the four movies I've watched the most. I love all those movies so much. College and school and stuff is starting back up again. I am so grateful to not have to do that because I only had a semester left of my associate's degree um, last spring but I dropped out because I literally could not do it anymore I just could not it was too much and uh, yeah, it was a horrendous time but we're up up now big ups so let's go and this ASMR channel is the only thing I really care about because I think it has potential to be something very, very cool and just big and really just the center of my life. And my right ear is ringing so bad right now. It just started right up. What the hell was that? What was I talking about? Yeah, college or in school. But yeah, um, so good luck to everybody who's going back to school. I wish you the best, the best, the best of luck. Study hard. Um, 
just use the camcorder mic, straight up camcorder mic, which you have to be really close to. You have to be really close to the ear. So that's why all my videos are so up close and personal. Because otherwise you wouldn't be able to be able to hear me. But I love um, the camcorder. It's the best thing in the world. We are coming up on a year of this channel, which I think is on like September 15th, which is crazy to think about. Um, making this channel was like probably the greatest decision I ever made in my life. Top three. <laughs> um, but yeah, I'm just so extremely grateful for everyone. I can't even put it into words. Um, yeah, we just hit 20,000 yesterday, which is insane. 20,000 people, that's crazy. Um, and just as a very interactive community, which I'm so grateful in the comments and chatting around. Um, yeah. I couldn't have asked for literally anything else. Like, this is all I've ever wanted. So, I'm just so, 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 so grateful. I would never be able to express just that much. But, yeah, you guys all mean so much to me. And, uh, I really, really do appreciate every single We'll see you later.